Here is a quick video on how you can make users inactive within Sage Intact. So from your applications dropdown, you want to be in the company module. Under the admin tab, click into your users. And for whichever user that you're trying to make an active, you're just going to click edit beside their name. And when you get in here, then you're simply going to switch their status from active to inactive. And you're going to save that. It's going to pop up, ask you to verify your password so that that can take effect. So let's say you come into a user and you have certain fields that are grayed out. So for instance, here for Emma Penny, I can't edit user type, admin privileges, or her status. That is because Emma Penny is the administrative contact for the company. So if you need to change that, you will have to go to the company module, setup tab, and under your configuration section, click into company. When you get in here, then you're going to want to edit it. You can only do this if you have full administrative privileges as well. Under your administrative contact, then you're going to change the user from whoever it's not supposed to be to whoever should be. And in my case, I'm going to switch to myself and I'm going to save that. That's going to refresh. Then I'm going to go back to my admin tab into my users. Now, if I take a look at Emma Penny, I can change her status. So that might be just something that you'll need to do to get a user out of the system. So I'm going to switch her from active to inactive. Hit save. And then it's going to ask me to verify my password. I would put that in, hit verify, and then that would take effect. If she has been inactivated and I still want to see all of the users that have been a part of the system but are inactive, I would click inactive, include inactive to bring them all up. And you do have the option to delete out, but simply making a user inactive is going to free up that license. So that's just a quick little video. I hope that helps. And as always, like and subscribe.